The electrical systems on the Dreamliner are catching on fire. What do we do? Oh my god, no, we've seen this before. Lithium ion batteries do it all the time, but one of my favorite companies is swooping in with a solution. <laughs> Hey, Trace here for DNews. Elon Musk has offered Boeing, Tesla, and SpaceX batteries to help fix their grounded fleet of 787 Dreamliners. Boeing, I think you should take it. Don't cram me on a 777 next time I fly to Japan. That would just be rude. We all know the Dreamliner story, it's been around for a while, but the fact that lithium batteries explode shouldn't be new to anyone. You guys don't remember the summer of exploding batteries in 2006? If there is a single short inside of one of these lithium ion cells, the thing heats up faster than a teen at a Bieber concert. Faster than a Midwestern woman reading Fifty Shades of Grey. Tyrion Lannister at a whorehouse. <laughs> the reaction can be so energetic that an iPod could catch a man's pants on fire or a laptop could completely burst into flames. But we're not here to talk about stories from 2006. So what the heck does this mean for SpaceX, Tesla, and Boeing? Well, according to a tweet from Musk, he's in a conversation with a head engineer at Boeing, and I did get confirmation of that from Musk's media people. It does seem like a great idea to pull in batteries from a company that makes electric vehicles and can fly into space. There are sure to be some roadblocks. Every piece of commercial electronics has batteries of different sizes and shapes and voltages. It's not like this is just AA batteries or anything, so it's really unlikely that Musk is going to be able to just slap in some Tesla batteries and call it good. This is yet another advance from an emerging company helping out a legacy company. Boeing is a giant American manufacturer with roots all the way back to the 19th century, and SpaceX and Tesla are like 10 years old. The cooperation alone is awesome. Not to mention, it's hard to do an internet search on this topic and not find Elon Musk quote from an Esquire article where he says Boeing puts the zero in being. He has come forward since then and said there's a lot of fiction in that article. It could just be friendly trash talk. My favorite part of this whole thing is this is a practical example of what space enthusiasts have been telling detractors for years. Space technology is not only inspiring but practical. And Tesla batteries were developed for extreme uses both up in space but also here on the ground. For example, when a Tesla Roadster gets in a crash, the batteries are designed not to explode. How convenient. If we know that lithium ion batteries are somewhat dangerous and they can explode and catch on fire, why do we use them in every single thing from cell phones to spaceships? because their power to weight ratio is the best for the cost. There is newer and better technology available, but it's not really ready for commercial use. Two of my favorite battery technologies are from QuantumScape, which uses minuscule layers of stacked particles and moving electrons to provide the same bang for your buck as fossil fuels, and then Alveo technology, which uses water and Prussian blue dye, which is essentially dye for blue jeans, to create batteries. Seriously, would you be more or less likely to fly in a Boeing 787 if you knew that they had Tesla and SpaceX batteries beneath your feet? Get charged up and let us know down in the comments and keep tuning in twice a day, every day. Thanks for watching. Stay energized.